The script calls for your character to choke. There's a difference between dying from choking, which we'll get to later, or choking on some food or water or something like that that goes down the windpipe the wrong way. All you gotta realize is whether or not your character recovers from this, whether they have any air coming in, and whether or not it leads to their death or demise. So if you're drinking a drink, it goes down the wrong pipe, you inhale a little bit of food and it gets lodged in your throat. The first physical thing that you're gonna try to do is expel it <coughs> through a cough, a blow. <coughs> and when you've ever done that before in real life, you know that that cough continues for quite some time, that you're, you can't get that sensation out of your throat. If it's a quick thing, like <coughs> you just coughed on your thing, go immediately to coughing, but then take a breath of air and go back into coughing again. Let it continue to um, affect you. If it's something like food lodged in your throat and you're actually choking on it, you can't have air. And what's gonna happen to your body is you're going to immediately try, you're going to indicate the throat. You're going to clutch your stomach. You're going to try to give the Heimlich maneuver to yourself. You're going to go into a state of panic because you cannot bring a breath back in. For the first few moments as acting, you want to make sure you exp you can't get the breath in. Push forward. Let your uh, blood rush to your head and flush yourself a little bit. You don't want to get. You don't want to pass out. You don't want to be too much. And as an actor, we can take little uh, breaths in our moments of. of of expelling, but there's no expelling either because the food has blocked your thing. So there's no in or out. It's just panic. So play the panic more than anything else, not than the choking, and just indicate a stop. Pushing panic and then get it out there. <coughs> and then recover from it. You want to be careful that you don't actually lose your breath, that you don't actually let yourself pass out from being too, put too much blood rushing to your head. You need to take little catch breaths in the moment when you're caught up in that thing. You can actually breathe in in that moment. You just can't make it audible. Uh, so now your character has choked. Do they die from lack of oxygen or do they just cough? Want to learn how to cough or die from lack of oxygen? Choose one of those. <laughs>